Tonight, we are hearing from a young cancer patient who had to evacuate from Houston to Omaha during Hurricane Harvey, but he is excited to come back home, especially after an invitation from J.J. Watt. Janelle Bluda joins us now to explain. Janelle. Sherman, it's been such a big Christmas for this little 10-year-old boy. First, he beat cancer, having to live the past several months up in Nebraska for treatment. But if that wasn't amazing enough, now one of his biggest heroes has become his new friend. It's hard to tell Santa what you want. When all your dreams, when my dreams, I really wish that you could meet me, have come true. And he said, let's make those dreams come true. Laying on his parents' bed, his sleeping brother in the background, 10-year-old Stephen Garay is telling me what the past few months of his life have been like. When I found out I had cancer, I felt sick. Cancer, the result of several transplants he had years ago. Stephen and his family had to be evacuated during Hurricane Harvey. Until the hurricane started, like in the middle, but my stomach was swollen like big. For chemo treatments in another state. It hurts. But today, his pain is, well, gong. It's the crashing sound of success and the triumphant smile of a kid now cancer free. A victory heard all the way back home in Houston. Steven, I saw the video of you ringing the bell. It made me so happy. By none other than Texans defensive end and Steven's very own superhero, JJ Watt. I'm so excited for you. I just want to send you a quick video. So excited, Stephen had to reply. Thank you for tweeting me back because I didn't even know you were going to tweet me back. And one final tweet from the football player. And he said that he was going to let me be his special guest on the field next season. A kid, cancer free, now with a bright new gear before him. I think it's going to be a whole new life. Watt is also promising to send Stephen a special gift. The family plans to move back to Houston as soon as they can find a new home. So definitely mm -hmm. a Christmas to remember. Oh, that is so special. And uh, I loved all those jerseys lined up on he's the couch. Got, he's got the collection, let me yeah, tell you. Yeah, you know what his favorite number is, 99. <laughs> definitely. All right, thank you, Janelle.